Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So in this video we are going to talk about the Resection Remix latest ROM. That is the Resection Remix 5.8.5. So let's get started. So guys, the first thing of course you can see the entire UI of the phone. It is very different from UI. Let me just focus and it is the brightness of this thing. So as you can see, it is very different from UI. You have to swipe up to access all the apps so as you can see we have got all the apps in the app drawer there and the status bar is very different it is not a no good wrong so as you can see we can slide over here and so let me just increase the button so guys as you can see this is over the home screen of the phone and if you go to settings okay Okay, so this is the setting of the phone. It has all got those black themes as you can see. And I'm gonna close up the phone. So as you can see we have got the Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, SIM card, data usage, customization. So guys, this is the option many users would like. As you can see we have got our let me just zoom in. We have got our status bar, notification drawer recent animation interface bottoms and everything can be customized here i will show you this in a bit and we have got a display settings here so as you can see we have got a maximum brightness adaptive brightness rotational setting night light and etc and the wallpaper is also there and sleep timer screen heads up wake on plug and all that stuff so i'm gonna again just yes so high tech sensitivity you can use your phone with with wearing gloves and the battery performance as, as you can see is very very great it's better than the Mi 9 global beta ROM and it is very stable ROM so as you can see it is running on the Android version 7.1.2 and the device name model is Redmi Note 4 Android security patch is September so that's a good thing and as you can see this is the final build that means that there are no 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 good release roam after this so resurrection remix are working on audio update for this phone right now which is going to out soon after a couple of months it is going to roll out so as you can see have the, so let's now talk about the customizations so if you go into the status bar option you have got all your customizations there you have got your clock customization you can customize the clock so the clock is in the left side you can either click it center right or I'm gonna click it again left and you can show the second if you want I do not want that so I'm gonna disconnect that and so we have got our date of position everything can go on font size and there are lots of customization you can get your network traffic here so as you can see I've got my traffic there network traffic it tells the speed so you can see so guys the next thing I've set up the fingerprint in this phone so let's set the fingerprint scanner speed in MIUI it was extremely fast so as you can see my finger is there, the phone is there. I put my finger and the phone unlocks. So let's do 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, they didn't recognize, sorry. 3, 2, 1, go. So it takes a half a second more, but it will be become faster in the audio update we are going to get. And the, as you can see, the UI of this phone is very different. And the status bar is very, very different. So as you can see, the status bar also can be fully customized. This is this portion is basically called the header. You can apply wallpapers to this basic section. So that's what I have done. So and if you swipe down, you have got all your notification toggles here: Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, mobile data, battery percentage. You can toggle the battery saver from here only. The portrait, the mood, sync, cast, data saver, and all that stuff. So, so guys. We are going to go into the customization again. So this second one is the notification panel. You can customize the header. 
as I was telling you this image and uh, you can customize the interface the LCD density pixel as you can see I have set it up to 400 for better quality image and more clarity so font size is 100 percentage fingerprint option is there FP unlock is there you can lock your phone after rebooting your device by fingerprint only no need to use a forced password you can customize your call here dashboard and as you can see we have got a classic customization no good customization subset it to classic because it looks more classy and you've got your input options and heads up display so the next button is the buttons you can get your own navigation bar here as you can see this is called a fling option so i can get as you can see right shot swipe if i swipe to the right it will the back option as you can see and let me just open this as assistant has been opened as you can see right long swipe and right shop okay the multitasking panel and there we go recents so if you don't want this option you can always get the back normal one that is this one smart bar as you can see i've got the smart bar options you can also customize the animation of the smart bars and one minute just okay i'm not gonna open the whatsapp and as you can see i can open any app with this navigation bar on the right but who needs that navigation bar that's question is for you if you have the on screen home buttons so as you can see the home buttons still work you can disable them in the option if you want and these can be like i mean can be color matched like the status bar it can be red it can also be red customized and if you play music it is going to be very great so i'm gonna click here on edit and there is going to be option called let me just open that navigation bar visualizer so as you can see we have opened that i'm gonna open wink music so as you can see we are going to listen okay i'm not gonna play any song because yeah so okay for two seconds i'm gonna play the song so as you can see the the equal equalizer has started here okay so i'm gonna pause the song there so as you can see this also works as an equalizer for the songs and all that stuff so that is up for this video guys if you enjoyed this video please share and subscribe the channel and like the video thanks for watching guys see you in the next one